They're also artists, and I think they make a big mistake. They grab at everything. I'm just known as the person that, like, I don't respond to money. So, you know, a lot of things have been thrown my way, and they're like, they, no, I don't see, think you heard me, like, how much it's for. And I'm like, I don't think you heard me. I'm exhausted. <laughs> like, In I other can't. words, some rich guy is having a wedding or something. Oh, and that's he happened says, before. We'll pay you yeah. this amount of money. And I was at the end of tour and I told them, I'm not saying yes to anything else. I can't physically. I'd had walking pneumonia steadily for like six months, I feel like. Like, I just couldn't get well. You'd think young Kelly Clarkson would say, you know what? That's insane that someone's going to pay me for an hour, $2 million. Yes, but like also, like, I think young Kelly's still the same Kelly. Like, I just don't. Everybody, I look, I like to pay my bills, but when you come from nothing, you realize you don't need that to survive. When you got done with American Idol and you start to become this big singing sensation, you had to give them six albums, right? I'm going to tell you something right now, actually. Simon Fuller, who is the head of all, it was Pop Idol originally, then it turned into American Idol. He was my manager and label at the, whenever I won Idol. And I'm going to tell you what, this is unheard of. I was so unhappy because he he wasn't really the one that was there. It was people working under him, and it just was not a good right. fit. And and it was like just um, character clashing. Like it was just not cool. Um, like literally, I had someone underneath him come to my house and put magazines in front of me. And be like this is what you have to do in order to compete with today. And I'm like. Here's the thing. I have no problem with people being who they are. If you want to be naked on the front of a cover, I think you, I am actually a nudist. I love being naked, but I just don't do that in work life. And so it's like, I have no problem with people doing it. But like when someone sits something down and is like, this is what you're competing with. This is who you have to be. And they just kept drilling me, you know, about who I had to be. And I was like, I'm just going to rock this and people can like be into it or like not. And I'm going to, you know, still be alive at the end of the day and it'll be fine. So, um, it was the people underneath that I didn't like. And I called him. I was doing MTV's Iced Out in New York. And um, I called him and I was just crying. And I was like, you got to let me go. Like, you're not here. And I am, I am miserable. And I've been doing this for years now with you. And he literally in that moment said, oh, my gosh, Kelly, I had no idea. I'm so sorry. Like, of course, I will let you out. I will not only let you out. I will help you find management if you need to like i will refer you he let me out and i that never happens you never hear what a decent guy no he's simon fuller's an incredible man you didn't get along with uh clive davis he took over rca and you probably thought wow great clive davis he's a genius this is gonna be so good out and he i was invited to his house like upstate new york he we had a dinner i was so excited i literally it was like a dream come true working with this person that had worked with so many people that I love. The problem with he and I is he literally was like, you just need to shut up and sing. He wanted me to be a Whitney Houston. I love Whitney Houston. We know this, but I don't want to be her. Like I was like, that's not like he was against all the guitars, like with Sinjimi Gone or Miss Independent, even that first single that I came out with, like it was just a really hard relationship. That was not a good relationship with me. Now here's the thing. I don't prefer him and will never barbecue with him. But do I think that he's had massive success with other artists and is like obviously done sure. really well? Like obviously. Right. Um, he just I didn't just get did you. I not into it. Yeah. He didn't get you.